Hello everybody in Argentina. Uh, well, I think you know, most of you know me. Anyhow, I'm Grandma Subin Boss. Been in Argentina so many times and always enjoyed it so much. Hopefully, come back soon again. Well, I'm in Poland uh, at the moment. There is an IAC, so, and I have one student that uh, needs to be ready for his master, so I'm here with him in order to see that he is good enough to go for the grading. And this IAC, there was also uh, Master Leo, who's uh, teaching around the world. That was really interesting, I really enjoyed it, and I also learned uh, from that how to uh, teach to children that have some problems that are hyperactive. And this, this was uh, good comments from Master Leo and also I think that the participants were really happy to hear something new. So that will be a good future for the ITF to continue with this, uh, with this course. For the rest, uh, well, Master Leo is asking me about myself. I'm doing fine, like always, always training, always busy, uh, working on my new project. Um, my new project will be uh, a book uh, with all the 24 patterns. This book will be in English and in Spanish, with the pictures, uh, of course, of each movement and also intermedia movements we we'll put, so it will be something a little bit different than the books that are on the, on the market at this moment. Of course, uh, there are many books and they're all good, but I just wanted to make uh, something different. So hopefully at the World Cup in Slovenia, the book can be presented. So I'm working on that and I'm very pleased with that. I will do, I do it together with my son, with Timothy Boss, and with uh, my, my master in, in Rome, Jan de Jager. So, we almost finished all the pictures because you can understand 24 patterns, there's a lot of pictures, there's a lot of work. But uh, it's moving forward and we are, we, are, we are getting there. So the next question is how things are in Italy. Oh, in Italy, uh, Forte Mundo is getting better because we can go back to the gym and, and teach. There are also a little bit of restrictions. But anyhow, uh, most of the clubs just started to teach again. Unfortunately, we, uh, we lost uh, quite some people. We lost people in, in our team, of course. But I think from October this year, it will be getting back to normal because most of the people, they need the vaccine and the green cards. So this is very important, otherwise you cannot enter the gym. And for the rest, the activities uh, starting again. We had some degree tests. In October, I have the meeting with my masters. All the seven and eight degree will come for three days in a nice place that we can have some good time together. So we train together, we have some social life together. We talk about the rules and about regulations in order that everybody is pleased with the future. So I think that it's going well. For the team, we are preparing to go for the European Championships that we have in November in, uh, in Spain, in Benidorm, where the Spanish organization FEST is doing all his best to make this uh, championships going. Because you can imagine with the COVID, there are always some countries that have a problem to travel. So hopefully it will be all okay and uh, because they put a lot of efforts and uh, we need to be, yeah, we need to help bringing our people, so we are getting ready with our team, with our coaches, so that's looking promising. The other question is about the World Cup in Slovenia. Well, you can imagine that uh, it was cancelled for 2020 and a lot of work ha already had been done. I mean, all the hotels were booked for, most of the hotels were already paid for, you can imagine. Master Thomas, this is not an easy uh, situation. So now we are looking forward to receive all of you to get ready for the World Cup in Copper 2022. We're putting all the efforts to make a, a super week. It's not only about the competition, it's about the city, the environment, it's a really nice place. So it will be a, an enjoyable week. Uh, and 
of course, we imagine that you, also, you are all planning to come. So try to do your best to support the evening event, support the ITF, because we want to make this even the, the biggest one. Uh, I, I'm just in charge of uh, organizing things together with, of course, with the ITF technical committee, with the IT committee, with the umpire committee. Uh, of course, they have to do their job. I'm just there to coordinate with them to make it as good as possible. So hopefully we 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 meet among a long a long friendship. I'm looking forward to seeing so many people that I have not seen for such a long time. Because you can imagine, also in 2020, I had no possibility to travel to Argentina, or to Australia, or to New Zealand, or wherever any country in the world. So, for sure, you get you are like all getting ready to be present at the World Cup. So we look. I look very much forward to meet you.